Hello supply chain friends. After watching my recent video on do supply chain certifications help you in job search, some of my followers who are either fresh graduates or they are considering to switch to supply chain as an industry reached out to me and expressed the concern that uh, a lot of these supply chain certifications are pretty expensive and since they are still considering to enter supply chain, is there a free way for them to get a flavor of supply chain and understand the fundamentals without spending a lot of money? So in this video, I will share with you the top five free supply chain courses which are available online, which I strongly recommend, which will not only help you understand the fundamentals of supply chain, but may also pave the way for you to prepare for these certifications in the future. My name is Jameel Hai. And I've been working in supply chain management positions across South Asia, Middle East and North America for the last two decades. And my mission is to help supply chain professionals like you build real life skills for your job and career that they don't teach you in college. And if you're applying for a supply chain job anytime soon, you should definitely book a session with me because I'm going to take your resume, the job description you're applying for, and based on a combination of those and my 20 years of experience, we'll give you some laser guided tips and tricks which can maximize your chances of success. So, so go ahead now and book your session. So on number five, we have Allison. Now Allison is a pretty popular platform which uh, offers a lot of free and paid courses in the supply chain space and in a lot of different industries. And the course I'm recommending, which is free, is called Supply Chain Management and Capacity Planning. And what you will cover in this course is the basics of supply chain management. It also covers topics like just-in-time and materials requirement planning. Uh, you will also learn about 5S and lean systems. They also covered the eight types of waste and the just-in-time principles. It also covers uh, corrective and preventive maintenance. Uh, it also gives you a list of different forecasting methods. By the way, I've also covered the list of different forecasting methods in my video on how to prepare for a demand planner job interview, which you can watch by clicking over here. And in this course, you will also learn about the key factors to consider when choosing a location for a warehouse and so on. And in this course, you will also learn about the capacity planning process. On number four, we have Udemy. And on Udemy, there is a course called Complete Supply Chain Management, Logistics and Shipping. So this is another free course where you'll get a very good idea about things like procurement management, uh, logistics and transportation, inventory management. They cover concepts like EOQ, which is the economic order quantity just in time, uh, first in, first out, which is basically one of the uh, warehousing strategies, product lifecycle, quality control, uh, and they also touch on the reverse logistics topic. And then this course also covers cost management. So what is the concept of landed cost? How do you calculate it? Uh, and so on. So a very good course that gives you a pretty good overall well-rounded view uh, of supply chain for free. On number three, I've actually got four courses which are offered as a bundle if you sign up for free for this platform called SCM Dojo. It's a very good platform because they have brought in uh, excellent resources on supply chain management, not only in terms of the courses, but in terms of uh, the best practices, industry uh, studies, and what I really like about this platform is that it's not only covering the theoretical aspect of supply chain just in terms of courses and so on. Uh, with some of the courses, they also offer uh, templates which you can download and implement in your day job, which is very, very helpful because if you are a supply chain practitioner and let's say you are a supply planning manager and you are learning about inventory management, uh, this platform actually also gives you the tools. So it will give you uh, a downloadable version of an inventory model which you can just you know simply plug and play put your uh, SKUs and uh, your product portfolio and it will tell you like how much inventory you need to keep so it's a pretty good platform so coming to the free courses uh, when you sign up for their basic uh, subscription which you can see on this screen is for free uh, you get access to four courses so once you have set up your profile, you go to their academy section and then you can see these four courses. And what I like about these courses is that these four courses touch on all the key dimensions of supply chain in a nice way. So one of the courses is introduction to production and operations management. The second course is effective communication for supply chain professionals, which uh, I've mentioned already in a number of videos that I've created in the past that uh, as a supply chain professional, you need to have very, very good communication skills. It's something which I've also covered in my uh, recent video on how to find entry level jobs in supply chain, which you can watch by clicking over here. So uh, in this bundle, you actually get 
get a very good idea on what communication skills in supply chain uh, would look like. Um, and then uh, the third course, which they are offering on this platform for free is Mastering Supply Chain Management. Uh, so this is a little bit more kind of, you know, an in-depth uh, roundup of supply chain. And then similarly to supply chain, they are also covering Mastering Procurement, which is awesome because procurement uh, is an integral part of supply chain, although uh, we have also covered this uh, point in uh, my video on how to prepare for a procurement manager job interview but procurement from a skill set point of view is a bit different than the core skills you need in supply chain but because uh, procurement is where the supply chain process really starts from right so if you go back to the score model which i have covered in my past videos which is uh, you know plan source make deliver return uh, and enable uh, procurement is all about the sourcing uh, portion of the supply chain right so what i really like about this four course bundle is that they are giving proper attention to the procurement procurement area which is uh, not often the case on a lot of other platforms especially when they are offering free courses on number two i want to recommend to you a free course on linkedin learning now linkedin learning uh, will basically give you these free courses if you sign up for their uh, one month free trial after which of course they will start charging you so if you really want to not spend any money and just take these courses course you sign up for linkedin learning get this course and afterwards you can cancel your subscription but i'm personally a huge fan of linkedin learning so i use it a lot for my own learning uh, in in supply chain and even beyond so the course i'm about to recommend to you for free on linkedin learning is called supply chain fundamentals and it's um, basically designed and uh, delivered by a guy named eddie de villa he is the associate chair of uh, the supply chain management program uh, at the arizona state university and uh, Arizona State University is one of the best universities uh, when it comes to supply chain programs. If you look at uh, the US news ranking, which is considered to be the most, uh, I would say, reliable ranking on US universities, uh, you will always find that uh, Arizona State University is up there in the top three. So it's normally like there are three uh, common names that you will find whenever you look for, let's say, uh, uh, the best places to do an MBA in supply chain, for instance, you will always find uh, the Michigan State University, uh, you will always find MIT there, and you will always find Arizona State University. These three, they keep switching positions. Sometimes uh, MSU becomes the first, just like it is right now, MIT goes second, ASU goes third, sometimes ASU takes the first position. Uh, but these three universities in the US uh, are probably the best when it comes to the supply chain programs. And therefore, I'm putting this course on number two on my list because it's for free and it's offered by uh, someone from a university which is very, very highly ranked. And I think if I look at the uh, contents that they are covering in this course, they are also pretty cool uh, because they uh, talk about the different parts of supply chain. They also talk about the keys to successful global supply chain management. Uh, they get into the concept of inventory in supply chain. Uh, explain how to choose a supplier and then work uh, with supply chain in different industries. So it's a very well-rounded course because it not only covers the theoretical aspect of supply chain, but it also tells you a little bit about how it's implemented in different industries. And finally, on number one, there is a free course offered on the edX platform. Uh, and that course is called uh, Supply Chain Fundamentals. And this one is offered by MITx, um, which as I, if I go back to the list I just shared with you, MIT is definitely the number one technology university in the world. Uh, and uh, when it comes to supply chain, it's always up there amongst the top three universities. And in this case, this course is mostly free. As you can see on the screen here, there are optional upgrades available where you can pay. Uh, but for the most part, this course is free. The difference is that this is not an asynchronous course or this is not a course where you can take uh, whenever you want uh, it's offered on certain dates so for example the next ones are april 2nd 2025 and august 2nd, uh, 27 2025 uh, but the advantage of taking this course and that's why i put it on number one is that it not only gives you uh, a very good basic idea of supply chain uh, but it's also offered by one of the most renowned universities in the world so you know you can put this on your profile as well that hey you know i've done the supply chain fundamentals program from mit which uh, can be very helpful for you uh, when you are applying for jobs and so on.
uh, what they cover in this course is uh, how to incorporate uh, uncertainty and risk in supply chain management how do we do customer segmentation now customer segmentation i've talked a lot about customer segmentation i think in my video on uh, customer supply chain manager which you can watch by clicking over here uh, it's a very very important concept and i'm glad uh, although this is a fundamentals course uh, but they have covered this piece there they also talk about forecasting methodologies for each segment uh, identify design and implement appropriate inventory replenishment policies for each segment and this is a very important concept because uh, your inventory policy heavily depends on what type of product uh, you are basically trying to manage right so for example if it's a seasonal product uh, let's say you are selling christmas trees right or you are selling uh, chocolates which are also very seasonal around christmas eid diwali and so on uh, your supply chain strategy will be very different than as compared to if you are uh, selling milk which is kind of you know the demand is more or less flat throughout the year so uh, that's what they have covered in this course as well and finally uh, they also talk about optimal transportation routing uh, and uh, choice of you know different modes of transport when you should choose uh, road transport versus rail transport and so on and so forth so an excellent opportunity here for you to grab for free uh, it's offered by MIT uh, but the challenge is of course that uh, it is only offered on certain dates of the year but you know if you cannot make those dates there are other four options uh, I have also suggested to you uh, and I strongly recommend all of them uh, in that order so I hope you enjoyed this video I've also made videos on topics like the highest paying supply chain jobs in Canada and how to improve your supply chain resume using AI where by the way I have covered another excellent free tool which is offered by this platform SCM Dojo which we covered in this video just now uh, where you can upload your resume and it gives you a very supply chain oriented assessment of where your resume is good and where it needs work so uh, definitely go and watch those videos and keep watching and do subscribe to my channel.